What's up, my name is Misha for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to add a domain to a cPanel hosting package, as well as updating the DNS records for the domain to point to the hosting package. Go ahead and log into your cPanel hosting package. You want to scroll down until you find the domain section. Under the domain section, you'll see there's an option that says add on domains. Go ahead and click on that. This is where you'll be adding your new domain to your hosting package. So the first option is new domain name. You're gonna type in your domain that you wanna to add to your hosting package. Subdomain, it'll automatically fill out a subdomain for you. You can always change this to maybe be dev.mesh.digital or you can just leave it as the default. You can leave the document root as mesh.digital or you can change the document root to whichever root that you want. You'll click add domain. And then once it's done, you'll see that the add-on domain has been created. You can click go back and you'll see that the domain is now here. This domain has now successfully been added to your hosting package where you can now create email addresses or you can install WordPress to start building your website. The next thing that you'll need to make sure of is that your DNS records have been updated to point to this hosting package. My add-on domains name servers is currently using Cloudflare. So we're gonna go ahead and log into Cloudflare and update the name servers. Once you're logged into Cloudflare, this will be the home page. You'll see that mesh.digital is here and it is active because it is using Cloudflare's name servers. You can go ahead and click on your domain name, click on DNS settings, and this will bring you to the DNS settings for your domain name. To find the IP address for your hosting package in cPanel, you can go back to cPanel to the main screen and on the right hand side where it says shared IP address, it'll be this IP address here that you'll need to add to your DNS records. So we're going to go ahead and copy that. We're going to go back to Cloudflare and we're going to update the DNS records. The three records that you want to update is the 2A records. So we're going to click on edit. We're going to change this IP address to the one that we got in cPanel. Click save and do the same for the second record. You also want to update the mail record. This will be for your emails for the domain name to enable you to receive emails on your hosting package. The other DNS records like the MX record over here and the SPF record, you might need to contact your hosting provider to get the correct DNS records. But once that is done, allow 30 minutes for the DNS records to update. Once the DNS records are updated, you will have a working domain name that has been added onto your cPanel hosting package. And that's about it. Thank you all for watching. My name has been Mish here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.